Hello traders, welcome to Simple Trading Style and today we are going to talk about daily stock market update and we will figure out is it still bullish trend or it's a bearish reversal signal what's going on with the stock market world on daily time frame. My name is Vadik, let's move to 5 rules of risk management. Please read it and follow it every single trade and you will be successful. Now it's a time for Vibull. Vibull, let's start from index chart, daily index chart. Market was flat all day, it did jump and it did reversal at the end of the last I don't know, 20 minutes. One hour, 20 minutes, right? Uh, yeah, it closed kind of neutral flat. NASDAQ minus almost half percent. Yeah. Let's move to my watch list and we will do technical analysis review. If you want to learn more about Vibull setup, just go to the description. There is the link about Vibull setup training and other links about all my trainings. Now let me briefly mention about my setup. I'm using uh, simple mo uh, moving averages, white line MA moving averages MA200, purple line MA100, blue line MA50, yellow line MA20, red line MA10, green line MA5. Below MACD indicator lines, RSI indicator lines, awesome oscillator bars. That's all very simple, it's not easy because emotions involved. If you follow the indicators, you will be successful because indicators do not have emotions. Like on my chart, look at that green line, MA5 did bearish crossover over red, it was bearish trend. When green line did bullish crossover over red, it was bullish trend. DXY, daily time frame for entry and exit position for swing trading. Recently, 10 days ago, MA5 did bearish crossover over 10 and 20. It was bearish trend. Several bars, they are kind of dancing around MA200. MA200 strong support. We'll see, will it bounce from MA200? It's kind of fight between MA200 and MA20. Bars couldn't break MA20 and couldn't break MA200. Still kind of fight, fight, fight mode, sideways trend. Q's daily time frame, still bullish trend. Nothing changed. Still all time new high bullish trend. Bearish divergence on MACD, RSI, awesome oscillator. 4 hours time frame, same story, bullish trend, bearish divergence on MACD, on RSI, yeah. On MACD, on RSI, on awesome oscillator, all indicators, they still have bearish, bearish divergences. One hour time frame, same bullish trend, bearish divergences, and, and started bearish reversal signal. VXN volatility index for NASDAQ still in the bearish territory, still bearish trend. SP 500, SP 500, same like Q's. It did all time new high, 5,000, 5, almost 150. Created tail, tail reversal, yeah, created tail reversal tail bar. It definitely wants to have some correction. Multiple gaps below. Still bullish trend, bearish divergences on all indicators. Bullish trend, bearish divergence on all indicators. One hour time frame. Also bullish trend and bearish divergences on all indicators. Still bullish trend. Now let's move to VIX. VIX plus 3%. Uh, still in the bearish territory. Still below all moving averages. Still negative, still bearish. It has yeah, built some bullish divergences, but still bearish territory. 
DIA Dow Jones. Dow Jones still bullish trend, bearish divergence on all indicators. No changes. Still bearish divergences on every indicator. Four hours time frame, bullish trend, bearish divergences on all indicators. One hour time frame, SMA5 did bearish crossover over 10 and 20. Bearish reversal signal. Bearish reversal signal on all, all indicators. One hour time frame. And now let's move to VXD volatility index. Also negative bearish. No fear on the market. Still extreme grid. IWM Russell 2000 daily. Last bar above all moving averages. Bullish trend and bearish divergence on every indicator. Right? Bearish divergence on every indicator. Um, now let's move to 4 hours time frame. 4 hours time frame, bullish trend, bearish divergences on all indicators. And one hour time frame, bullish trend, and bearish reversal signal on all indicators. Apple. Let's start Apple daily. Apple still bearish, right? Bearish trend, SMA, wanted it bearish crossover over 200. It is bearish. Set up bearish trend on all indicators. Four hours time frame, same bearish crossover, bearish trend on all indicators. MA50 did bearish crossover also. One hour time frame. One hour time frame, it, it is in a bearish territory, bearish trend. Bearish trend on all indicators for Apple. Tesla, let's start daily. Tesla still, it was bullish and it did bearish reversal today. Strong bearish reversal. Last bar closed below SMA20 in the bearish territory. Four hours time frame, bearish reversal. Last bar closed below all moving averages. Let me clean the, bar, the charts. Bearish reversal trend. One hour time frame, bearish trend, last bar disconnected from MA20. But still bearish trend are, are assigned the oversold territory. NVIDIA. Nvidia bullish trend and it did all time new high 370, 870, almost 77, almost 877. Bullish trend and bearish divergence on RSI and still bullish trend on all in on, on the price action. Four hours time frame, same bullish trend, another gap up. Yeah, bearish divergence on RSI. One hour time frame. Still bullish trend, last bar still above SMA 10 and 20. A lot of gaps, but still trend is bullish on all indicators. Microsoft. Microsoft did bullish crossover, bullish trend. Uh, on daily time frame and bearish divergences. Four hours time frame. Still bullish trend on all indicators. Huge bearish divergences. And one hour time frame. One hour time frame it started bearish reversal signal. 
on all indicators. Still above last bar above SMA MA 20, above yellow line, still in the bullish territory, but MA5 did bearish crossover, it is bearish reversal signal. Amazon, Amazon daily. Amazon daily last bar above all moving averages, bullish trend and bearish divergences on all indicators. 4 hours time frame, bullish trend on all indicators and bearish divergences on all indicators also. Bullish trend. 1 hour time frame on Amazon, bullish trend and bearish divergences and bearish reversal signal. MA5 yet bearish reversal over 10. Bullish trend and bearish reversal. And Baba Alibaba group, it is bearish, right? Baba bearish. Let's start daily time frame. MA5 yet bearish crossover, last bar below all moving averages, bearish reversal trend. Similar like Tesla. Let's move to 4 hours time frame. Bearish reversal trend. It was rejected from MA200. Bearish trend on all indicators. And 1 hour time frame also bearish. On the other side, it is in oversold territory. But setup is bearish. M MA20 yellow line did bearish crossover over 200. It is negative bearish setup. That's all very, very simple. Let's do summary. USA dollar still, still in the flat mode. It's still not a negative flat mode. I still believe it can bounce because of the bullish setup, but we will see it next few days. All indexes and equities still in the bullish trend, except, uh, except Apple. And Tesla and Baba, Apple and Tesla and Baba in the bearish trend, but all other equities and special indexes bullish on daily and four hours time frame. Only on one hour time frame they switch some bearish reversal signal. Like Qs it switch because of the not yeah, it was kind of hold positive Qs because of the NVIDIA. Because all other stocks did reversal today, only Nvidia was positive. Anyway, indexes still bullish on all time frames except one hour time frame. All just started bearish reversal signal. That's all. That's all from my side. Let's move to disclaimer. I'm not a financial advisor. This video for educational and informational purposes only. Remember, for educational purpose, we are using Paper Trading Simulator. Thank you for watching Simple Trading Style videos. I do publish daily, weekly, my monthly updates for stocks, ETFs, indexes and cryptos. Please subscribe to this YouTube channel. Click like button to support this channel. I really appreciate all your efforts. Thank you so much and good luck. Bye now.